Hi, so today I have to go ahead and clean the coop because they're molting and they have feathers everywhere. And then after I do that, I thought I'd share how I pick all my eggs. So on the last video, I showed you preserved food methods because I like to keep it super simple. I am gonna show you one of the methods I do is I pick all eggs also. Now, I'm, I don't have a recipe for this because I'm still experimenting, but I do have a recipe on the pickle onions, so you can go to my blog, I'll link it, and you can go and see that. So it's kind of the same idea, but I'm adding eggs and some other things to it uh, to change it a little bit, you know? But for now, that's the hummingbird. <laughs> she sees me out of here and doesn't like it. When I have the recipe completed, I'll share it with you. But right now I'm just sort of playing with the recipe and I thought you might be able to get some ideas. Now these eggs will last you two weeks in the fridge. It's not super long term. They go so quickly once we do them. We put them in salads, side dishes, even breakfast. They're a snack. They're super delicious. Once I have the recipe all ready, I will share it with you. But for now, I don't have it ready yet. Well, let's get going and cleaning. Before I get going, I'm gonna have one of these. <laughs> this hydrangea is turning the pink mauve color that it doesn't fall for. For some reason, it started blooming again, a new one. <laughs> it's so bright white. They are molting like crazy. You can see all the feathers everywhere. There's just a lot of molting going on. Their water is clean, but I'm gonna get everything out to try to clean them really well. a lot of eggs in there. I love raising quails. They provide me so much food. The eggs are super delicious. And having the coop has been pretty good. It's not that much maintenance when you have sand as the base of it. And we have custom built like an upcycle idea that has worked so well for us since we get so much rain here. One day I will go into details on how we build this chicken coop and upcycle an existing coop that we have gotten. amazed how many eggs they have laid because they're molting pretty badly you can see the feathers uh, this is a great harvest great for pickling
I prefer to keep my eggs on the counter and when I'm ready to use them I just drop them in warm water and let them sink and whatever doesn't sink and flows I know it's not a good egg and I get rid of it. They just last much longer this way. I do want to let you know that my footage got corrupted unfortunately. This is an older video I had and I really wanted to show you how to pick all the eggs because I think it's something you can be doing right now for the fall and the family would really enjoy how delicious they are. change been through a lot of pain some things are not the same as they were a year ago but all will be okay i move on each and every day the past is where it stays way back a year ago i've changed for the better this time I thought I would never be fine I strive just to say I'm alright And for the first time in a long time I'm alright I've seen a lot of change Been through a lot of pain Some things are not the same As they were a year ago But all will be okay I move on each and every day The past is where it stays Way back a year ago I've 